Okay, we should be recording. Today is, I think, yeah, today's the 14th of uh, February, 2021, 2023, Jesus. Anyway, uh, yesterday, my friend Mike came over, and we spent about two hours and a half, two hours and 45 minutes. I say we, he, he was one running the computer because I'm absolutely useless on a computer other than buying shit on eBay and Amazon and email and a down and dirty video on YouTube. That's the extent of my knowledge of a computer. And we were unable to make the batteries communicate. We were unable to, I don't know if I'm using the right term, firmware, software, I don't know what the hell he was looking at. But anyway, whatever it was, the numbers he was getting didn't match this, uh, Version 2 battery, it's got its own deal going on. Uh, they give you three cables with this. Uh, there's a yellow one, there's a black one, and there's a can, which I don't know what that is, and that, I guess, is just the Ethernet port. I don't know. I don't do this stuff. Then there's a battery in the COM port down here. I don't know if you can see them. And we tried every combination possible under the sun. Another little tip I can give you is uh, the cables that come with this uh, basic version. You need to get it in the cable long enough to go from here to the bottom over here, which I believe I found in my pile of stuff. So anyway, um, they don't really tell you which one of these to use. We used them both, switched them all around intermittently. Don't know what this one is, there's no information. So uh, we were on hold on the phone for about an hour and 20 some minutes, maybe an hour and 40 minutes, listening to how important customer service is, and we never got anything out of them. So I'll make a long story short, uh, he took the information home, and in his spare time, he's going to email EG Solar and hopefully work out what the problem is. This is all way past my capability. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to show you. I'm going to start with the positive bus bar. I'm going to remove this. I got my shrink wrap yesterday. Now I'm going to shrink wrap it. And then I'm going to come back and do the same on the negative bar, which I did flip, which is going to enable me. It's probably not showing up, but I'm going to be able to hook my two negative leads, four rock cables, from the bottom of that bus bar, run them diagonally. And I'm going to put the two tops up here which will allow me to hook up the batteries. There's plenty of uh, tapped holes there with little rib nuts in it. So that's uh, not an issue. So I'm gonna take this bus bar down, put it up on the bench, and uh, I'll show you what I'm doing. I'll be back. Just an update on the EV EG4 setup. More to come. Okay, here's another little update. I got the bus bar off, and the disappointments just keep coming. These bigger bolts with the rib nuts that I assume are to hold your uh, battery cables in. Look what happens. You can't get the nuts out of them. They strip right out without even trying. Isn't that nice? Absolutely lovely. And then these take the little tiny bolts that actually aren't very impressive at all. Okay, more to come. Isn't that something? That is piss poor. That's hard to believe, actually, to be honest. I'm going to have to use nuts and bolts. Wow. How about that shit? Okay. You've been warned, and the bolts, again, on this positive bus bar, require an 8mm socket to take them off, except they don't, because uh, they're just put in finger tight, and I just took them off with my fingers. So that's nice to know. Anyway, all right, I'm going to wrap this up. Put some shrink wrap on it. I cannot believe this. That's just amazing. Isn't that nice that fell off while you had your power connected to it? That'd be just fantastic, wouldn't it? That is incredible. All right, more to come. Okay, I decided I'm going to show you this live. So you realize I'm not just bashing this. I mean, this is incredibly poor. Watch this. Those are the bigger nuts that come on there, bolts. I would assume those are for the battery cables. Look at this. Look at this. Ah, that one actually loosened up. Isn't that something? 
Yeah, look at that. That gives you a nice warm fuzzy feeling, doesn't it? Amazing. Hey, he's watching this live. I ain't making this up. All right. Okay, it's time for me to uh, step away from this project. I got to do a little investigating. As of this moment in time, this setup as it arrives from the factory, I have absolutely zero faith in it whatsoever. These guys ripped right out. They just pressed in the copper. Can't even get the nuts out of them. I may try to brush these down, attempt to solder them in place, so I'm probably just going to use a nut and a bolt. That is absolutely amazing. So there's a heads up. If you get one of these uh, bus bars, hmm, check them out good because uh, bad things are going to happen. That's just, I just can't believe that they're selling that stuff. And here's another little tip. Uh, if you get the version 2, they come with these uh, handles that come over here. Okay, and when the handles are on the battery, guess what happens, kids? They hit the bus bars. And that and they great. So if you take the handles off, the bolts, the little teeny bolts, can be used to hold the battery in. Oh man, between yesterday and today, so far, so far I'm a little on the disgusted side of what I'm seeing. All right, I'm gonna post this and leave it at that for now. Come back when I figure this how I'm gonna get around this arrangement. Probably going to have to use nuts and bolts. I don't trust those bus bars the way they're put together. That's pretty crappy. Absolutely unbelievable. And again, the bolts holding it to the isolators. Took them off with my fingers like I did the other side. These actually look like they got crushed properly. See how they're smashed over on the end like a rivet? And these apparently weren't deep enough. See where they started to crimp? There was no crimp, they just pulled out. And it looks to me, I don't know if we're catching this, that's exactly what the problem is. They're not deep enough, they didn't go through the bus bar. Oh, Chinese shit, that's what you get. All right, I'm gonna walk away. I'll let you guys take a look at this and you can make your own decisions. I'm just trying to share information as it shows up. I'm going for now.